Well, this is an extraordinary sight. Goose bump inducing. The awe-inspiring entrance of The Undertaker. Darkness has completely engulfed this entire building. Admit it, Byron, you're scared. A little bit. We are seeing a legend in the flesh. The creatures of the night are out in full force tonight. Representing an unbreakable bond that the dead man has had with the WWE Universe for over three decades. I've seen this walk for 25 years, and I'm always in awe. The Undertaker transcends eras transcends sports entertainment. A true phenom in every sense of the word. of hell have just opened. Expect punishing power. Devastating strikes. All courtesy of the dead man. Hall of Fame worthy dominance. And I truly believe in a matter of moments we will see yet another victim rest in peace. One of the biggest names in WWE, The Viper. The Viper won his first WWE Championship at the age of 24. The youngest world champion in history. Such an accomplished career for this young man. But gentlemen, we know that the Viper is at his best when he hunts alone. I do not envy this competitor at all. This superstar is gonna have to contend with the unmatched striking and power of The Undertaker. The following contest is a steel cage match and is for the World Heavyweight Championship. Introducing the challenger from Death Valley, 
Weighing in at 309 pounds, the And his opponent, from St. Louis, Missouri, weighing in at 245 pounds, he is the World Heavyweight Champion, Randy Orton! The energy in this arena is palpable. These competitors know exactly what's on the line. Traditionally, things have to get to a pretty heated place for superstars to end up in a steel cage. The cage is designed to keep all interference and distraction out of the equation. In the steel cage, it's just you and your opponent. Nobody in, nobody out. And a big time knee drop. Sent into the corner. Turning the tables there. Big punch to the body. To the back. Pinpointing the leg. Punishing the leg. The legs are a base that you do not want to lose. Chopping down the tree at the base here. Oh no. Stun gun. Going for a pen for the championship. The champion with a quick shoulder up. Just using the adrenaline to stay in the match. We're no closer to a winner just yet. With interference much less a factor when inside the cage, what does the victory come down to? I hate to use this cliche, but it's who wants it more. With nowhere to hide, this match is going to come down to who's able to take more punishment. That's mounted with punches and not... Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. Return fire from the Undertaker. Reciprocating the initial reversal. Undertaker gets reversed. Benji Jordan! Into the penitent. There's two! Just before the three. Whoa, that was close. Aside. 
this is just establishing dominance. Oh, what a stop right to the chest. Are you kidding me? Orton's incensed and shows no signs of backing down. Yeah, but the Undertaker's fire can burn a hole right through the Viper. Right oh. leg sweep. Nicely done. And it's a long way down from there. Undertaker retaliates. I think we know exactly where the dead man is heading. I bet he's going to the top rope, Byron. The old familiar sight. Boom! And attack for the championship. seeing right now no one can the undertaker with the six for the championship and only gets a one count wow orton always has an answer a plan he needs to find that right now the dead man has decided this ends now Seeing that, it's hard to imagine what it's going to take to keep this competitor down. And you have to imagine Taker might be gaining some sort of begrudging respect for him after that kick out. But you also know he has a job to do, and things are only going to get uglier now. Oh, goodness! And he hits the map with a thud. Yeah, he's going to have to try something else now. Counters the Viper's attack. What a hilarious. This doesn't look good. Ouch. That's one way to get your opponent out of the corner. He's making his way up the side of the cage. It's going to take a lot of willpower to make it all the way to the top. Oh, a strong impact. Fortitude being tested with every step. Dismayed, but we know the Viper is adept at remaining on the offensive. Listen to this place. Being carried around with ease. That one goes to help Undertaker. And he's already taken more hits up there than he should have to handle. He's got him scouted. Each competitor showing they've done their homework. Reversal after reversal, proving they did their homework. These two showing how well scouted they each are. Big boots! Jeez. He's determined to make it to the top of the cage here, guys. And every inch climb puts you in a more perilous position. Making the big climb towards victory.
Listen, someone needs to ring the bell before this situation worsens. Gotta wonder if the stamina is there to make it all the way. He's all the way to the top of the cage. Not many options for him. He's working toward making his escape. He can almost taste the win in this cage match. Heck of a view from up there, but he'll enjoy a view from the floor even more. Some superstars doing what they do best. Here are the highlights. Here is your winner, and still World Heavyweight Champion, Randy Orton. Orton did it. Somehow he did it. Tonight, the Apex Predator was at his absolute best. Tonight, Randy Orton systematically dismantled the dead man. The Apex Predator survived the perils that lurked within the Valley of Death. Orton took down the dead man with the exact precision you expect from the Viper. Well, we know two things. One, this was an incredible victory by Randy Orton. Two, you can't kill what's already dead. Rest assured, guys, The Undertaker will rise again.